This is Corey Hoffman of the Cybex Research Institute, and I'm here to tell you a little about strength training for runners. Runners tend to get injured very frequently, and almost all of these injuries are overuse injuries. This means that the athlete has progressed too quickly for either the bones, tendons, ligaments, or muscles to handle. With this in mind, we can do two things to attempt to reduce the injury rates of runners. The first, and arguably most important, is to progress slowly and carefully when increasing the distance, frequency, or intensity of running. The second is what we can do with strength training, strengthening the muscles and tendons, increase bone density, and improve the power of the leg musculature. What I'm going to do today is outline three strength training exercises that you can do to supplement your running, and how you can get it all done on just one machine, the Eagle NX Leg Press. The first exercise is the traditional leg press movement. When doing this exercise, our research shows that starting with the seat in its most upright position will increase the demand to the glutes and hamstrings, while reclining the seat will shift the demand to the quads. To most effectively increase strength, find a weight that you can do only three to five times before failure. Although the leg press will target the calf muscles to some degree, it is also beneficial to isolate this muscle group in training, which brings us to our second exercise, the heel raise. This can be done by moving the foot plate farther away and dropping your feet to the bottom of the plate. Try performing the heel raises with a straight knee or a bent knee to target different muscles of the foot ankle complex. A third great exercise to perform, especially if you enjoy running trails, are power focused repetitions on the leg press. Leaving the ground by applying explosive force into the plate and return in a safe, controlled environment. Also consider varying your takeoff and landing positions. This will also be effective at targeting the smaller muscles of your feet and ankles. Often, injuries like slips, trips, and falls occur not because we are too weak, but because we are unable to generate force quickly enough to recover from a loss of balance. With that said, strength training with a focus on power can be extremely beneficial. Research suggests that muscular power is most effectively increased when working at one-third of your maximum strength and performing these repetitions as quickly as possible. Remember, no matter how strong your legs are, if you run too far, frequently, or fast for your body's current capabilities, you're at risk. By incorporating strength training into your running schedule, you can strengthen the musculoskeletal system such that your body is better equipped to handle the stresses that you impose on it. Consider incorporating some strengthening exercises into your routine before you get injured in hopes of potentially saving yourself some frustration down the road. 